books in Nadia's nook. Today, we're reading Breathe With Me by Mariam Gates. In this book, a little girl uses many different ways to breathe to stay calm throughout her day. What's something that you guys like to do to stay calm? Well, come on, join me in your jammies and grab your favorite cuddly friend because it's time for... Ramadan books, Ramadan books, Ramadan books in Nadia's nook. Welcome back to my nook, everyone. Are you guys all comfy in your jammies? Great, me too. Who's ready to read? Bismillah, let's begin. Breathe with me by Mariam Gates. You are always breathing up and down, in and out. You use your breath each time you talk or sing for every whisper and every shout. Your breath can be short and quick like the drum line in a marching band. Your breath can be long and slow like the waves rolling onto the sand. You will breathe 25,000 times today and that is healthy for you. But do you know what else your breath can do? One deep breath in and one long breath out can make you feel better too. If you are tired in the morning and it's hard to get out of bed, use rainbow breath to get your body moving and wake up that sleepy head. Rainbow breath, sit up and let your spine grow tall. Bring your arms out straight to the sides, palms down. Inhale and sweep your arms up over your head, palm to palm. Exhale and bring your arms back straight out to the sides, palms down. Repeat three times. When you go somewhere you've never been and you aren't sure what to do, you can use dandelion breath to feel more comfortable trying something new. Dandelion breath. Sit up and let your spine grow tall. Imagine a soft dandelion flower. Take a deep breath in and then blow the air out slowly, sending the seeds into the air. Repeat three times. When something makes you mad or even feels unfair, try counting breath and you'll feel calmer there. Counting breath. Sit up and let your spine grow tall. Take a deep breath in, counting silently. One, two, three. Then let your breath out, counting silently. One, two, three. Repeat three times. Sometimes you may be sad and feel like crying too. A gentle belly breath can help when you are feeling blue. Belly breath. Lie down on your back. Place one hand on your chest. Place your other hand on your belly. Take slow, deep breaths and feel your chest and your belly move up and down as the air goes in and out of your body. Repeat three times. At night, when it's hard to fall asleep because your mind is busy and your body feels tight, try balloon breath to get relaxed and ready for a good night. Balloon breath. Lie down on your back and let your hands rest by your sides, palms up. Inhale through your nose and imagine filling your body with breath like a big balloon. Exhale and blow the air out through your mouth. What color is your balloon? Repeat three times. Your breath is always here for you in a calm and quiet way. Use it to help you choose how you want to feel in each moment of your day. With one deep breath in and one long breath out, you are on your way. 
so much fun learning about all the different ways to breathe? I think so too. Which one was your favorite? My favorite was rainbow breath. During Ramadan, it's especially important to be calm and patient. So next time something makes you really upset, try one or two or all of the breathing types we learned about in this book. Inshallah, I can't wait to see you guys all tomorrow night when we read another book in my nook. Until then, good night and sweet dreams.